Hey, Family Fun by A Crew. <laughs> <laughs> I'm apologizing, okay? So listen, if you haven't been here before, welcome. And if you've been here before, welcome back. I am a single mom of seven children, which I do have still six in the home. I do everything from the rooter to the tutor, as my mother used to say, from the sun up to the sun down, okay? And even when the sun down, I still be doing stuff, okay? So listen, I does it all. And I am a mama on a low income, but baby, I get it done. I'm not going to have no excuses, none of that. I'm going to be a little sad because I ain't bringing in what I know I could. But life be life and things happen and you got to make the best of it. And that's what I'm doing. Okay. Well, uh, good morning. Stop spreading those rumors around. Stop spreading your lies all right good morning um merry early christmas happy early holidays um today is a good day because guess what i got the kids out for school y'all so today we are going to do a little shopping do is we're going to go in target we're going to look at the one dollar two dollar three dollar five dollar section and then I want to go to um, Five Below. We finally got a Five Below here in the Bay Area. So that's over in the Bridgepoint Shopping Plaza. I think that's what it's called. Um, it's Foster City. Or is that 17? Foster City? I don't know. But however, we finally got us a Five Below. I want to check it out. So here is what's going on today. I mean, I ain't already said it, but listen, this is how it's going to go. I need some lotions. So we have a budget. I have a budget per child in mind. Am I going to stick to it? I don't know. We're going to see. So I'm thinking about, I don't know. Well, we're going to see because the only thing is I'm going to try to find things that's in packaging and I could take one individual out and give it, pass it out. But the, here's the thing. I have one daughter. And five boys at home. So that's going to be a little tricky. This is what we're doing. We're here at Target. We're going to go get us a Starbucks. And we got our... We got our purse. Drink. I mean, our purse. Our cup purses. Now, I don't know which... I think I want to take this one. I already got on enough dark stuff. So let's take this one. We're going to get us our drink from Starbucks. And then we're going to walk around and see what they have in their one, two, three, five dollar section or whatever their section is considered. Then we're going to go to, I don't know where five and below is. Then we're going to go to five and below. And then that's what we're all we're doing today. Okay. So we're looking for the 12 days of Christmas little. Tr oh, and we have to find some bags. So maybe I'll go into like Ross or Marshall's for the bag. Maybe Ross for the bag. I don't know. We'll see. And always remember to strap your purse in. Nice seeing you. Are you in, in school? Yeah. Cause I'm like, wait, I don't never see her or her the car anymore. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, thank you. Okay, so my drink isn't the best. But my favorite friend made it, and I don't know what's going on, but however, I'm gonna keep it, I'm gonna drink it. It's not the best though. So let's get into what we came here for. 
and that is getting some 12 days before Christmas items. So let's check it out. Let me turn the camera around. See, they have all these things for the girls. I mean, all this kind of stuff. So, my daughter definitely wants the tree hats. Hey, what is this? Hmm. hmm. It's not uh, like a real potent smell. It smells like a like a yogurt almost. But I like the five fifty nine price. Okay. So all the holiday, ooh, okay. This pumpkin spice is only three ninety nine, but it's not doing it for me. Ooh. Now this iced coffee, that actually smells good, but I don't know if she's gonna want coffee. Tropical mango smells good. This is regular. Oh, that smells real good. Cotton candies, plain, basic. Ooh, watermelon. This don't do it, I think. So watermelon and tropical mango has my nose. Okay, let me get away from here because what I'm going to do is so that my daughter can have the one that she wants, I'm going to wait. All right, family from by 8 Cruz. So I ended up getting a phone call and I still wanted to record. So here it is. I'm recording and you can't hear a sound. So what I did do is I picked up a 12 Days of Christmas Grinch socks. And I was just taking a look around to see what all advent calendars they had. Anyhow, <clears throat> excuse me. I was checking out the different ones. They did have Mickey Mouse. They also had Minecraft. And I couldn't figure out which one to get. So let's check out um, the clearance section because I'm like, listen, there has to be something cheap. I want to get all the kids 12 items before Christmas. So they were going to be wrapped individually. So I stopped and took a look at some dresses for me, but then I kept going and voila, <laughs> this was the best section ever that they came up with because it was perfect to find some things for my daughter, daughter that was inexpensive and cute. So we took a look at the sweater earrings right there. So I have previously wrapped those in wrap with me videos. So you can check that out. Those were like only um, $3.99, but I think there was a little bit cheaper once I got them to the register. But those were so cute. Then I got some hair clips. Uh, matter of fact, I got two hair clips and I couldn't decide on which one to get. I didn't get the smiley face ones that I first touched and I wish I had of, but I did not. But you see, I kept going back to it and I should have gotten what I went back to. But anyhow, one of the clips was only like $1.50 and the other one was like $2 and something. Like that one. I think that one was only like $2. And then the pink one I'm going to get was only $1.50, guys. Oh, my goodness. Not that one. But you'll see I'll get another one. Um, I was looking through and I did like the little wallets. They have um, some cute hoop earrings, which I had thought about getting, but I decided not to. And then um, I saw the necklaces and the bracelets 
And then there was something else. Oh yeah, that one, that's $1.50. And then there was something else that I was thinking about getting. And I'm like, hmm, I don't know if I should waste my money because I know how my daughter is. So yeah, I just decided to go with that. But then those earrings, I mean, not the earrings, the rings next to the earrings I got, and those were only like maybe a dollar and something with the evil eye. So I took a while to go through this clearance because they had some really cute stuff right in the range of what I was looking for. So the lower the price, the better for me. (laughs) It was just too exciting. So I kept looking around, looking around, hoping to find so much, which I ended up doing. Yeah, guys, I can shop, shop, shop all day long. As long as somebody keep feeding me some money, as long as somebody keep handing me the money, I'll shop, 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 shop. Hey, hey, shop, 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 shop. So yes, those rings were really cute. And I know she's into rings right now. Uh, I want to get her some real rings, but I need to see how she do with these rings. Then let's hop on over to the boys and the boys love Play-Doh. So I do have a couple of boys with a disability and one is a learning one was from birth. So this is really easy for them and they love it. Even all the kids actually love Play-Doh. Now I just need to get some molds so that they can mold the Play-Doh because they like to combine the colors before they even make something. So I'm just like, what fun is that? Those it were... On the tag says 55 cent, but when I rang them up, I believe they were only 13 cent. So that was a win-win for me. And I had I known that I would have went back and got more. Matter of fact, um, they were 50% off. So maybe a little bit more than 13. But however, it was a good price for me. Okay. Um, I was taking a look at the different toys, trying to find, I think not slime oh clay I was looking for clay but I couldn't find any clay and then my boys one of my boys are into cars so baby let me tell you no actually two of my boys are into hot wheels remote controls and then big trucks okay so the monster trucks so I was trying to figure out which set to get I was going to do one individual toy per boy but I'm like no only three of the boys like the little hot wheels Mainly two, but three for sure. And guys, I said I was going to split that up. I ended up just giving that whole pack to the baby. And that was a cute pack. And I don't think they had any of those cars. But I just kept looking through to find which pack I feel like they have not had one of before. Because they do have a lot of Hot Wheels. And boy, oh boy, do we get a lot of Hot Wheels and go through a lot of Hot Wheels. (laughs) Yes, indeed. Um, you're going to see another video of me posting what my children got for Christmas again. So yeah, you will see Hot Wheels in there again. Yes, indeed. Oh, that's a cool pack. So yeah, let's get that. Cause come on, we got to get on girl. Keep moving. Keep moving. Okay. Now we're getting into a little treat. Now we're getting into a little treat. So I was trying to find some little inexpensive candy, but old school candy and the candy necklace is definitely old school. So they were $1.29. Um, they should have still been 50 cent. <laughs> okay, but however, we got six of those. Yep, we got six of those. And I kept looking and I'm like, nothing is like really catching my eye. I couldn't really figure out what was going to catch my eye. So let's just scurry on down the way. Um, still looking. And I'm like, a lot of this we just buy on the regular. So what are we doing for Kerma for a different type of candy? Okay. So let's just take a look. We're trying to rewind, go back, and still didn't come up with anything. Nope. Same thing we can buy in the store any other time. Put that back. Yeah, keep going. Um, Nobody wants all that. Mm -mm. So then I found the Spider-Man cup, and it was uh, filled with suckers. And I thought about getting that, but listen, we don't even have the cups that we have on an everyday basis. So why would I buy them a cup with a straw just for them to chew up the straw and then it'd be outside digging dirt up or up under the dirt like little dogs d- dig their stuff and hide it? Uh-uh, we ain't got time for that. So let's go on and hit this corner. And then on the um, end cap, I was looking to see what I can find. And then uh, let's see what we got, what we got. 
Oh, the little light bright. Oh my gosh. You guys, I can't wait for you to see the video of what I got the children so you can see the light bright. I thought it was a barbecue grill. <laughs> A little play barbecue grill for the kids. And baby, it was a whole light bright TV, retro TV set. It's so cute. I can't wait for you guys to see that video. So, um, oh, is that the gingerbread train or the elf on the shelf? I don't know, y'all. Listen, I'm just making this up as I go, talking as I see. And um, I was like, oh my gosh, okay, here's something different. We're going to give them Pringles, okay? That's another gift, because listen, this mama trying to do what this mama going to do for these kids for Christmas, and I thought it was would be a cool idea to do the 12 days of Christmas. And they open up a gift every day leading up to Christmas. Excuse me. <sighs> yeah, just like how I'm yawning now, I was getting tired in that story, y'all. Um, So we're shaking the seat, make sure... The chips not broken. Guess what? All the chips are broken. So, however, they still don't eat them. Matter of fact, one of the kids opened one of their gifts today before I could even film them. So, guys, I'm just like, well, wait a minute, y'all. Come on now. This was a thing planned in my head, and y'all not even following through with it. All right. Let's keep going. We smiling because the lady was coming through and the man was working and I don't know. However, let's keep going. Um, I think she was trying not to be in the video. All right, we're moving this stuff on down. Uh huh. Come on, girl, you're moving a little bit too slow. Cause I know that's how some of the people be in the video that be watching the videos go. Come on, scary, get to the point. Come on. Okay, now we're looking at more things, trying to find something that's a little bit different. Just a little bit different. Mm hmm. Yeah, come on. Yeah, sashay that head on to the side. Take another gander, and let's move on along. All right, so we didn't finally made it over to the mystery, the mystery toys. So the mystery toys actually ended up being a hit. This was like perfect because it was only $4.99, y'all. So I got one for each one of the younger boys, and that's three. So that silly one is for the eight-year-old. That was a perfect one. Oh, no, that one's for my baby with the disability, four-year-old. Mm-hmm. And then I couldn't decide if I wanted to do the dino or the jungle for the six-year-old because he likes either one. But I think we're going to go with the dinosaur because he is more into dinosaurs more than the jungle. But I almost started to get that jungle one. I think that was going to be for me. But however, I knew one for me. It was for the kiddos. So we're going to go with the dinosaurs. I was shaking them because each one of them felt a little bit different in weight. So I take it each one has something different. So I went with the heaviest one. You know, you got to get a little bit more bang for your book. So I felt like that was a heavier one for my five dollars. Listen, yeah, well, yeah, go on, smile it out, girl, because you know how you is a little stingy, okay? So now um, we hit the corner trying to go find some more stuff, y'all. We always looking for a little budget, a little pricey price to be down low. Okay, so now we over here on the other end cap. And baby, guess what? They didn't have nothing on clearance so you're gone about your way because you know you ain't about to pay for that so let's take a look at everything we got okay okay guys i am not walking down there i just realized how far down that is and i'm being lazy oh wait where's my park oh and i'm being lazy so and then i didn't realize i was gonna find some big big stuff for under five dollars so we're gonna put this stuff in the car and we're going to drive closer. I probably should have walked because I haven't been doing my exercise, y'all. And I see the weight and I feel the weight. But, oh well, let's get in this car. Okay, so for my oldest son, I'm thinking whew, I might have to spend a little bit more for him. Because he's 14 and I don't really know what to get. Ooh, I do know maybe like a watch or something from out of raw, something that's not expensive, but I'm trying to think boy. I don't know how to shop for boy, like big boys. Oh my gosh, this is getting out of source. So I use EBT for the food part guys and for the cash. Um, EBT total was $23.88. And then for the um, uh, 
And then for the cash, well, the total was 62. I mean, 66. So 23 of that was EBT, and then the rest was like 43 and some change. That was the cash part. So for the cash, we still have 45, 46, 47, $47, guys. So we still rolling. We still rolling. I decided not to get the socks um, because then that would have been minus whatever the tax would have been with that. So that was $15.99. And I'm like, you know what? We do. They do need socks, but... I'm not going to make that a part of this. I'm trying to get as much as I can. Now, they do need the socks. The socks would have came in handy. They all could have used that size socks except for the baby. But I was looking for something a little bit different. So, if they had to have the dollar socks like how they used to, then I would have got everybody just one pair of dollar socks. But, yeah, I think for my 14-year-old, I am definitely going to have to um, invest a little bit more for him and... I'm going to go into Ross. I'm not going to go in Marshalls for him because I know it's going to be a little bit more expensive, guys. And guess what? I, oh, it's a park right here in front. Okay, now I should be able to walk to Hobby Lobby from here. Now, we ain't not going to be all the way lazy, but we're going to be a little lazy today because I didn't let myself. Mm -mm. Okay, I'm going to pull some more cash. Well, I don't. Maybe I. I'll just use my card. But see, when you use your card, like somebody like me who's not all the way financially, um, mentally stable, <laughs> Woo! Uh, we tends to over. Oh, my shirt is dirty. What the heck did I rub myself up on? So this is my cup holder. And let's get it down in there snug. Um, now this time, since I'm going to walk, if I buy something, you guys will see how I hold it with the bags and how it works. This thing is actually very handy dandy. And then you can fold your straw in just so it won't be dangling and hitting your hand or whatever. Now I do want to give my daughter some lotion and I wanted to go to, um, I was about to go like this, to Sephora. I mean, that's Sephora. Why do you saying that Bath and Body Works? I missed all the good sales. Today is uh, December 6th. I didn't miss all the good sales. So I'll just get the little hand ones. That's like two something. I don't know. Anyway, let's get into Ross and down to Hobby. Not Hobby Lot. Oh, wait a minute. Where is Five Below? Oh, my brain saying Hobby Lobby. I mean, I'm my, my my mouth is saying five below, but my brain is saying Hobby Lobby. I just realized we're not going to Hobby Lobby. Wait, I gotta figure out where this is though. We might be doing all this walking. Hold on, y'all. 